Good evening, dear friends, and welcome to the Workers and Resources Soviet Republic People's Petroleum Prefecture, or something along those lines. Where, uh, fourth attempt, no, not fourth attempt, fourth installment, fourth episode here of this uh, series, very serious series on, on the People's uh, Petroleum Prefecture. Um, uh, the last time we had a little bit of an unfortunate accident with one of the residential buildings where half the population was living. I burned to the ground uh, and we lost half the population and that, that when was not possible to continue from that point, uh, unfortunately. So this is um, uh, trying again. Trying again before before the house burned down and hope that we have a little bit better, uh, to call it, uh, luck. Yeah, right. Chance with the uh, fire algorithm this time around. So to, yes, we have. We, uh, fire station is on the on the to-do list. Uh, very much prioritized, even. Uh, but uh, I also need to build a monument of some description to keep the people in in order. It would seem they have very low uh, productivity here, without with the loyalty as it is and so on. Um, Yes, so, so, so we shall try and see if it gets damaged, we can see it, so we have like, it, it, it takes a whole lot of time to load for some reason, there we are initialized. Great, so here we are. Citizen's happiness is very low, yes, this is all very bad. This is going though, which is good, uh, and this put put on the, the heating uh, the display. You see that everything is all right. Always show this overlay. Thank you. Oh, what can we do now? Better this time. I have a lot of uh, foot pops here. Yes, that's to the sauna. The sauna is finished, which is great. It's not finished. Where did you get that idea? The sauna is under construction. As is the, the prefab panels here. The prefab panels. The new building. The new prefab building. Yes. Um, it, it, again, it would not hurt to have a, another open hull. A truck here, but we can't. Can, can we be without a bulldozer? Sounds like an oxymoron almost. Or, or at least something that is very. It should be. A, we put you there and we, did, we, we get ourselves a second open hull. Whatever the bulldozer was doing, we can do by hand for the time being. Um. Maybe. It doesn't seem to bring the bulldozers to, to do the footpaths and stuff anyway. So, open hull, please. Um, 169,000 rubles, 323,000 dollars. Great. Open hull. Open hull. Uh, that's a bit large. No. Uh, open hull. I will take this one. You should have your work cut out for you with bringing in boards. Yes, very good. The plan is then get get people out of these terrible buildings and into this one. And also make sure that it's possible to walk to to the to the power plant from the new building, which it isn't quite yet, but uh, when, when these, these footpaths here are finished, will be. Uh, there's another one, and, and this, yeah, you need to be building. God damn it, that's a lot of stuff. Now it's going to be time to do all these things. And you, what, you don't have a, a source for gravel assigned? I have gravel here. That's where you're supposed to get the gravel, you know. From the ship. What's going on here? This looks a bit strange. Ah, whatever it was, it has stabilized. Great. Five people in the heating plant. Oh, maybe not quite enough. Yes, uh, the, 
the diesel plant is the power plant that is uh, is within walking range of, of this here uh, this this here thing. Yeah, that's right. I rebuilt the power line to have uh, to do something else with footpathing. Ne never mind that this time around. I think screw that. Uh, that didn't work anyways. Let's see if we can't also optimize the number of workers here a bit. Do we need this many? This many in the school? Yes, we do. In the basin, we, that's the smallest amount we can have. The doctor's office is also kind of slimmed down. Prefer panels. Do you have any on the way for us? Yes, you do. Slowly but surely, in the winter time here, it sort of grinds to a halt or something very close to it with this uh, dirt roads and uh, the uh, snowy conditions of them. It's a wonder that they can get uh, get anywhere at all here. It's as happy as seems to look, but the, the snow will melt in, in just a couple of weeks, so so it could be all right. With some luck. There's a lot of this luck involved. I think we can wait with this one for the time being. Make sure that they, they fixed these, uh, these here uh, footpaths and, and, and this building. Uh, so we're waiting for the truck. Come on, truck. Where are we? What are we going down here? We have been. Here we are. Nine kilometers per hour. This is walking uh, pace, basically. I'm on. You must be. You must drive faster. It is of the utmost importance. Yeah, yes, it's as happiness. Seems important. Our recommendation is to build immediately at least a few Soviet monuments in this area. Okay, to let it remind people that socialism is the best regime. Yes, but I don't have time to for, for building uh, monuments uh, and crap like that, you know. I have slightly more important things to tend to. This should probably also be finished, that it looks important. And this too is pretty important, but it can't be all the same importance. That is not going to work. Oh. Uh, monument, you say. So, uh, trees and accessories. Well, it, it, it does it plus 2.8% within 145 meters. 2.2%, 65 meters. 65 meters, that's not enough. You see, tape measure, tape measure, please. From this building to, to here, it is 200. Right, uh, tape measure, not done. From this one to here, it's very close. 88, but, but to 200 meters would be a good sphere of influence if we could get... Hmm. Ah, come on then. Uh, 70 meters, 150. Ah, it's only this one, that does red star monument. 19 tons of steel. 19. We're not made of this stuff, you know. It's, it's a very expensive stuff. Oh, that's fine, whatever. We'll, we'll, uh, we'll plan it in. That's good. The snow, the snow is melting. Uh, that should mean that the house is should be coming up. House, yeah. The, the, oops, the snow is melting. You need. To, you don't need to bring workers with, with the bus to to the to the building. You could have them do footpaths instead. People can walk to work here. You see. Hmm. Ah, such is it. I can't do anything about it. I can uh, merely watch the thing. 
go go to to to, to bad places. Uh, resource uh, thing. Uh, steel 108 within uh, close by 63 tons. That's all we have. And and of these prefabricated panels, 32 tons. It's not a lot. How much more you need here? 18. 18. Uh, <coughs> that's just about going to be enough. Okay, see if we can get get the boat or something to to go and grab some more prefab panels for us. This apparently has mechanical components. That's right. We need electric electrical components too. Um, that that has not been uh, fixed here. That was in an alternate reality. The in the alternate reality where where. It house sort of burnt down uh, yes g g electrical components you'd think after two and a half thousand hours in this Nyatan game that you'd be able to find it's already set it's set up very strangely this is not going to go well if you send it off uh, in this fashion oh you grab a bit of meat two uh not um, much electrical components uh food in that too and uh, prefab panels if you could uh, if you you can't no you you, you cannot uh, western borders uh, load uh, anything good go Do you have a lot of stuff on board, though? What? The, where? Where? I have a cargo harbor here. That's uh, so where we can actually fit these things. Maybe I have a ship going this this here too. Yes. How are you? Oh, you're all the way down here. I, I see. That's that. Right. Maybe not coming anytime soon because you're out of fuel. That's unfortunate. Very much unfortunate. Uh, why why can, can we get... F it has fuel. No, it doesn't have electricity. Why wouldn't it have electricity? Because uh, the infrastructure is not in place for electricity. And why the hell would you give me this board? I can't use. Uh, uh. No. Uh, but maybe we could. Uh, well, what do you do again? Do you, you do, don't do. I uh, do boards, uh, prefab panels. Uh, uh, go back here. Or prefab panels, really that. Ah, oh, the house is finished. Great, we can move people in. They, they, they might be a bit happier living. Though, this one, uh, you... Uh, only two people still living here, actually. Ah, oh, they can walk to, to the power plant from, from there, very good. Now we put put all the workers in into this building and it ought to make them a little bit happier. Also, remember there might actually be people down here still, which have not given up completely on on life universe and everything. There's no one around. None. Oh. Mm, okay. Well, we can at least get the people out of these terrible living conditions that they are currently in, and instead instead put them in to better living conditions here. And, and that's, that should be reachable, everything should be reachable from this one. Get rid of it. Well, I think that this, uh, them living here uh, in the uh, Soviet gloriness, glor glor glorious Soviet apartments, 
will be a whole lot better for the, for their happiness. More than a Gatan Red Star Monument is going to do. I don't know if it is so in the game rules, but it, it would feel better to live in a proper flat than, than in one of these barracks here. And it's spring here, here, in, here in Krasnoyarsk, so you should be happy. bit of your uh, existing infrastructure here, if you can call it that. Not much of infrastructure, but still, that's all we got. This also needs to be done. Right, uh, and to not have that happen then again with the, with the house burning down, a fire station is also very, very, very important. Yes, uh, you, we need to get a ship uh, here. This, I don't know what you're doing down. Ah, that. Are you here to be able to unload meat, perhaps? I'm not quite sure how this works. Should we find out or should we do just uh, uh, do, do something different? I need another ship, but uh, can I afford another ship? Bum, ba, dum, bum, bum. A river cargo ship. You do the things, yeah, you do. Not 153 tons of river pounds. That's not a lot. No. Uh, forbid. Do I need to, to, to do this? We, all, we can carry only this resource. And then we say we bring a, a few bricks. Remember, it is a very small, small ship. This uh, prefab, prefabricated panels, please. Prefabricated panels. Here are those third tons for now, sure. And um, steel. How much uh, steel? Do we, A sixty-three tons. That's quite a bit. Uh, electrical components, a tiny amount, six tons. Ah, uh, hmm. I can if we add those in later. Maybe it, 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 it's it's a smaller amount or not. Bricks, prefab panels, uh, wood. No, but about boards, planks. We actually, have quite a, quite a bit of planks. Is prefab panels that is the most. A pressing resource for the time being. Loyalty seems low. Yes, I'm working on it. We are working on it here. That that any any other construction material that you want to bring in whilst uh, whilst we're out. How much food do we have? Laying about 114 tons. You should maybe bring a little bit of food too. To whilst you're on your here and then and electrical components or a new stop beyond the west where you do load everything then you go to to, to our our cargo harbor here there or something is on fire what is it uh, please don't be anything bad I, no 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 it can't god damn it this is not going to work out if this, I'm screwed again. This time it was the the, the construction office. No fire when this is gone. I can't build anything. The hell, the damned fire algorithm. Why? What have I done to you to deserve this? Ah, quite a few vehicles in here too. Hmm. Yeah, you know, that was uh, another death in the Soviet Republic, right here, right now. Uh, and I messed around with a ship and something. Uh, yeah, that's how it is. We should watch it burn to the ground, and uh, I'll give up on this. 
At least we're in good health. 90%. There we go. That's this place. That's game over. This one that is. Uh, thank you so very much for watching. Okay. Yeah. Good night.